item this evening are some recommendations on the Unified Land Development Code for Lowndes County. J.D., please proceed. Yes, sir. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Commissioners, inside your packets, I've discussed during the work session and then emailed out there for uh, a little bit afterwards. We have approximately six amendments grouped throughout the ULDC. The main one being Amendment 1 to our signed regulation ordinances. <coughs> this was a major overhaul that we proposed to allow essentially more signage for a lot of the commercial development and growth we've seen as a result of the residential growth over the past five years. Uh, as you know, about 33% of all the variance requests that were heard in 2023 were for signage. Um, and so staff looked closely with our consultant, Lynn Coyne of Goodman, Mills, and Kaywood, and came up with the proposed amendments that are before you in your packet. The biggest one we've noticed was the additional uh, wall, one wall sign per wall. It originally read one wall sign per building. We've addressed some of the concerns regarding entrance signs for commercial developments, some trying to differentiate between automotive and then larger commercial traffic, such as semi-trucks, um, just allowing things provisionally, and then clarifying um, within the MAZ, the movie activity zone, again, differentiating between commercial development along the Venus corridor and then in the more rural areas, trying to get them, <coughs> keep them more rural and protect them. Uh, the overall, that, that the amendments, number one, the sign regulations were the heaviest. Uh, number two, conservation was clarifying uh, and being in direction with the Department of Public Health and how they uh, view water and sewer systems. Number three, uh, vehicle repair shops specifies the number of vehicles allowed because the, in the previous code it said X was the number and it was undefined, so staff uh, stuck a number on there. Um, numbers four, five, and six are again getting with the modern times. Uh, the changes in government and how we use digital technology now uh, is not properly reflected in the code from 2006, and so we made changes there again um, based on what staff is currently doing and board commissioners are doing, and we just wanted to reflect that in ULDC. Um, including uh, legal changes to the official board uh, code um, regarding variance notification. So that is a brief summary of those of those amendments. The underlying strike through format of those is in your packets if you have any specific questions. But otherwise, the TRC has considered and offered no official technical <laughs> objections at this point. Um, and planning staff recommends approval of these six amendments as presented at this point. Thank you. Good deal. Commissioners, any questions for staff on this matter? This is pretty deep, pretty intense this time. <coughs> Any other comments or questions for staff? That being the case, I will open the public hearing portion covering this matter. Is there anyone here this evening that would like to speak positively about these changes? Is there anyone here this evening that would like to make positive comments regarding these suggested changes? Is there anyone here this evening that would like to speak against these suggested changes? No one here that would like to make any negative statements about the changes. Thank you. Well, that will close the public hearing portion on this matter. Commissioners, any other questions or statements? Then I will call for a motion on these suggested changes to the Unified Land Development Code. Mr. Chairman, is the uh, recommendation to accept the changes? Is that what the recommendation, I mean, that's what we're being asked to do? <coughs> I think we're being asked, J.D., correct me if I'm wrong, to recommend approval as presented. Okay. Well, with that being said, Mr. Chairman, I make a motion that we do recommend approval of the changes um, to item number three, TXT 2024-01. Thank you. Is there a second? Second. Second by Commissioner Webb. All those in favor of the motion, signify by raising your right hand. Molly, I think that's unanimous. Thank you, J.D. Thank you, Commissioner. Thank you, Commissioner.